Hello and welcome to Backlog Conquering. It's part 3 with Pyre on PlayStation 4. Let's head in. <laughs> yes, it's the one of the most boring loading screens, but the point is, I don't quite remember where we are in the story, if I'm honest. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we've done the black wagon, we've done the snail, slug, we have spoken with the bard, and it's time for the rites. So, let's do that then. We will have to pick a team. Ooh. Yes, the game has had a wonderful feature where anything that's like highlighted in orange is something you can move the cursor on and you can read information about it. If it's something new, it'll flash. Or if, it off or if it's offering new information, it'll flash. So yeah, it's a really cool feature. you've missed the story so far. It is a little bit difficult to try and explain. You wake up in the desert, a group finds you. They find out you are a reader, you learn about the rites, and suddenly your group is the Nightwings. And we've been doing these rites, basically a game, a sports game, because when you win all of them, you can basically go back to civilization. But first, there's a tradition to uphold. That's a cool background. This time you stand against the dissidents. Even now they hunger to defeat you. Perhaps not simply to regain their freedom, but to deny you yours. Uh, yeah, cool flames. The art in this is pretty good, and the music's great as well. Oh yes, the Lone Minstrel is the guy who we got in the last video. <laughs> that little guy also appeared in the last video and I thought that he was just going to be an imp that powers the wagon but I guess not. Okay. Another joins your ranks. And we can fly. Although, no, it cannot be. Then we shall Little stamina depletes. Sure. Okay, I'm just testing out what it's asking me to do. A big radius. Okay. Let's 
So you can't do anything else other than boom. Okay, so it's nice that this new character does have a different way of controlling. Following the advice of the characters seems like the right thing to do. So yes, I will use the imp. Let's scroll. But I don't have anything equipped on him. Let's just do. Well, if he's not going to be in it, take that off him. Oh, I take that off. There we go. That on him. I've been enjoying using her. Kind of like the tank figure, so she's powerful, a bit slow, but very useful. I do have Tay, and she's very similar to well, <laughs> the first guy we picked. So, because she's similar and already have him on the field, I'm going to go with, what's that, Joe Dariel. Joe Dariel. I'll pick this as my team. So far, the rights have been kind of straightforward, but I am expecting them to get difficult soon. At the moment, my tactics are kind of just pass it. Ooh. Good. But the characters can only really move. Oh yeah, my guy is down at the moment. Ah, oh, nuts. So yeah, there is a cooldown on characters. Ah, nuts. Nuts. Wow, they're really catching, aren't they? Wow, let's just put this guy in the fire. Oh, no! They respawned. I, they had I got lucky there. My guy respawned. Oh no, that was a great pass. It was a little tricky. I'm hoping that if I use fling, that it will that all my characters will continue into the next round. Yeah, because I noticed recently that by using fling. So by running the ball into the fire, I don't have that character for the next round, and I want that character. They are somewhat attacking. That sort of cast move I just did. They are using it pretty effectively. 
Oh, just squeezed in between the two of them. Excellent. This is kind of competitive. The characters will only move if they have the ball. Oh, look at that. Running into the fire is the easiest way to score. But that also means that you only have two characters for the next round. <laughs> so there has to be yeah, let's run him in there has to be some sort of um, trick to moving the characters around when they have the ball because they don't need to move themselves looks like they've gone berserk Why, my explosion didn't get them. How? What? Oh, do you see that? They fired at me, but I still got it off. <laughs> Trying to be a bit too cheeky, maybe. So, what does that implosion do then if it's not going to stop them? Like a waste. Passing it at the moment. Ah, oh, let's run it in. <laughs> yes, we did it. Alright. A little bit more tricky. These rights do get a little bit more difficult each time. The right is done. Wow. Okay. What else could we pick? More stamina. Or we generate. So selfish or share. So this side is every team aspect and we look at this one. There's a lot more soloing abilities. I'm gonna go with the team side. The Master General reveals his stratagem. Witness the rights first hand and be inspired. Enlightenment seldom avails itself to simple imps. Okay, so what will he get? What it get? So faster moves. We spawn fast. Okay, automatic. It seems. I'm gonna go with this side. Is the influence of the imp scribe until the next rhyme. So also the game is fun. The story is I wouldn't say bananas or crazy, but it's still so much unknown. 
I think I said in the last video that we're doing these rights so quick, but it doesn't, it doesn't feel like we're doing the story that quick. This is normally quite easy. You see the big giant green thing. That's typically where we have to go. There's no kind of hunting or feeling it with vibrations on the controller. It's usually just big and bold with vibrations on the controller. What was that? Well, we could continue, but we've got some extra story stuff to do. So, best to do that. And plus, I think we saw that, but this thing appears flashing. So, that was a nest. Drive imps, yeah. But of course, there he is. We can ask questions now. Seems like a whole lot of denial. Well, seems to be one of the more. Well, actually, they're all kind of been quite nice to me. His. I don't know. Something about his story that. I want to know more. There's nothing really else for us to do here, so we just um, exit the wagon and continue. Normally, when we go somewhere, we're given a choice of a couple of things to do. So I imagine we're going to have a decision to make soon. And these transitions are still really cool. This game has got style, that's for sure. Kind of surprised I haven't played this earlier, if I'm honest. I've had this a long time. It's always best, I feel, to just check the wagon to see if there's anyone to talk to. No one here. Nothing flashing. Okay. This game has a little bit more of a um, kind of persona, social style aspect to it that I wasn't expecting. So, I, because I don't know how to play this, I don't know what the best results are. I don't even know what the story, how it's going to progress. I kind of just want to make make the best choices for as many of the characters as I can. So yeah, I'm going to keep checking on that.
if you missed the second video, the minstrel is a little a bit of a weird character. Because he was black, as in dressed in black. And was in the wagon and didn't do anything. And then he disappeared. And now he's a character. But he's a character that seems to have been part of the Nightwings before the current Nightwings. And that's where we got the idea that Nightwings as a team has existed for a long time. And we're just the current team. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Forgot to get rid of that notification. Yeah, let's have a look at this. We already have the book. And now we've got this. And the book's been giving us stories and telling us about the past. And this is now interesting. Oh, that's pleasant. Okay, a wraith. So what happened? Did she fail the rites or something? Why is she stuck in the crystal? Okay, so what should we see? What should we do? Yeah. Let's do something that's unique to one of the characters. I guess we should probably do her. She's the character we've used the most so far. Wait, e ineligible. So it's just him. Okay. Interesting. I wonder why. Hello again. Hmm. The game is not doing anything. I hope it hasn't crashed. You have to remember that this is a launch PS3. So <laughs> PS3. It's a launch PS4. A Japanese launch PS4. This game is running off an external hard drive. A powered external hard drive, so it's pretty fast. But yes, nothing is happening. Hold the pad PS button down. Well, that's working. Well, I'm going to restart the game, I guess. I'll see you on the restart. Alright, and we're back. It was a case of, I have no idea how this crashed. Because when I pressed the PS button, it just went to a blue screen. Nothing on the screen whatsoever, it was just blue. And I waited, and nothing happened for maybe like a minute, so I just hard powered it off. But I got us back here. 
also notices that this is about Rusky, this bit, so that's why we can only choose him. So, yeah. Okay, so let's pick a talisman. Um, let's take the that off. That one. Because he's one of the fastest characters we have. And here we go, it's working fine. No idea what happened last time. Because you remember last time, just before it crashed, we d it didn't give us the option to equip a talisman. It just did nothing. Alright, so let's catch up the story, let's see what's happening. Okay, to the point. Start. Actually, I tried to fling it, but it didn't quite work. <laughs> yeah, watch out for that. Did we get it? Oh no. My wave isn't going to get there. Ah, nuts. Thing is, I don't know if we're meant to win this or not. Like, if we fail, what happens to him? If we win, is that the goal? Yeah, that uh, wave is pretty dangerous. I can take one more and that's it from them. Around the back. Is that enough? Oh! Nuts. If I got a strategy. I had a strategy. Oh, I got the wave off. You see that? So lucky. Now I've got to try and oh, no, and they passed it straight away. Lost it. Okay. We'll try it one more time then. You can see what I was trying to do. I was trying to corral them and use the barriers as a way to avoid their attacks. Go around the back. See, they only got 50 health. Oh. Yeah, that was clever. I couldn't get the my own attack off.
Is that going to get there? Oh, no. But I got it. Oh, no, I don't have it. Ah. And they're now back to two. Great. I'll just have to do that. <laughs> That's that wave. That's a smart attack. I see there's two of them defending. I need a gap. I need a space. Down the middle. Oh no. <laughs> Here we go. Alright, this is much better. One more. Haha. <laughs> Use that trick back at them. Oh no, it's stuck on the field. Oh. They're all up here. Yes! Just got it. That'll do. Is that it? So that was happening with those big enemies. When they fired, the energy they fired, that wave, kind of lingered. And that's what got me a couple of times. That must be what this is. This is one specific for Rookie as well. I'm going to equip that on him. So we can put this one on this little guy. So he's quicker. Wait, why didn't that stay? <laughs> Pass, no idea. So, let's continue the story. I think what I might do to, for this video it might be a shorter one. That we might just go to the next right. So we can get a valuable item, or you can improve a talisman. And we've already got quite a few talismans. So I'm going to go for this one. You need that to level up the 
items. Read about the story. Again, looks fantastic. I'm going to make it bigger. Yeah, so in the last video we had this page. So this is a story about a king and a kingdom. And the king went to find a treasure that probably doesn't exist and his kingdom fell apart. But he wasn't a good king, so it was already falling apart. It was on her mind. Uh, not really. <laughs> okay. Well, that's nice. She got plus one hope. So this uh, slug guy, this is where you can upgrade your weapons. No, not um this is where you buy, isn't it? Yeah. I don't have enough coin for any of this. Now I think if we want to um Oh, we gotta go back to the wagon to do it, okay. So his is six, ten. Legendary five, six, six, six. Okay, um, let's give him a bonus. And that's all you do you drag and drop onto what you want it to do. You know what? Uh, let's pick a team. This is a bit of a short video so far. Let's at least try it. Um, his character is pretty cool. Trying to think who I'm going to pick. We don't have Rookie in. We haven't had him for a little bit. Well, he didn't do the last one. He's got that talisman, so we might as well try and use it. Why, you made it, Rita. You made it all the way 
way to the detestable pit of the Middle East. Now some grotesque thing in the background there. You have disturbed your ancient adversaries. The withdrawn. The deranged witch who leads them has big plans in store. Should she prevail in all this? Now, as you know, I normally would wish you a shameful defeat. But in this case, I wish you a little bit of luck. Okay. Whoa, that's a picture. Yeah, I think it's less hope because of that. <laughs> so, definitely want to put him in because he got that new toy to play with, essentially. She's got more hope than the other one. You can see up here on the top, she's got seven. Well, actually, well, doing pretty good. Yeah, he's quick. He's got good hope. I can't thought about putting her in, but he's got a lot of hope. Yeah, so is she, and we haven't had her for a little while. <laughs> if, it's, if you know your soccer, it's kind of like squad rotation. Worry about that strange aura around that mean character in the middle. Now begin. Oh no. I'm hitting the wrong buttons, that's a really poor start. Oh, what was that? I didn't get away quick enough. Nuts, and I didn't change character either quick enough. Oh boy, that was a really bad start. Full of mistakes. Yes, I threw it in, and I still have three characters because of that. Interesting attack, that's for sure. Oh, missed. Oh, that was lucky. Aha! It was worth it though. Now ahead. Even though we're down to two characters. This is difficult. This is a really, really difficult one. Just put it in the fire. We've got to keep close to them. Whoa, what happened there? Ah! No, 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 no. 
Not like this. The orb flies through. Oh no. The Nightwing's oh, adversaries have gained an edge. <laughs> Out with the rookie. Yeah, let's put it in there. Ah, uh, poison. The witch invokes a broken yeah. name. I shall repeat. Best beware of that. I have to go around. They're trying to fling it. See, we've got the north. We can go north. What? what hit us? Oh man, I can't do anything. I'm blocking it, so I've got to get rid of those two. Full 20, there we go. We can win it in one go now. We can't go that way, we've got to go around. Ah! I couldn't change character quick enough. Wait, where's the imp? This little guy can fly, I forgot about that. Still need one more. Just run it in, mate. Just run it in. There we go. <laughs> yes, that's another one. But that was tougher. That really was. The ceremony. Is complete. I'm definitely going this side, flinging the orb faster and not using stamina. Very useful. A devious trick from the rope collar. Starting to feel like she might be kinda powerful. Until the next right. Are they gonna say, is this wagon a boat? Is that what's gonna happen? It's 
So are we actually going to have to travel? Wait, I'm actually going to have to find it. Oh no. It's the big, <laughs> the big one here. Oh, that's a picture. We are going to have to go into the water. Okay, so it's not going to be a transforming wagon, but it looks like there is a boat or something. Alright, he's here, so he wants to talk. Yeah, of course we'll hear him out. Okay, so he's a titan. Oh, so that book you can see in the picture, that's a part of him. I wonder if that's going to be like the story McGovern, the thing that's going to make it so we don't just rush to the end. That this bad guy is actually not regenerating, that he is actually ready. I wonder if that's what's going to happen. So instead of us just finishing the rights, maybe something else is going to happen. So we'll go to the town there, and then we'll call it a day. You see top corner it just auto saved so yeah we're gonna end it there again still got me hooked there's definitely gonna be a part four to this story it's the rights itself is quite difficult but the story is still pushing me forward so yeah i'm really intrigued it's got it's got its hooks into me it's a really good story this would make one weird kind of anime kind of like a one season show you know still watch it I tell you I still would I wonder if anyone ever f came to them about making a TV show out of this because this is weird but in a good way it's just a shame the PS4 crashed it really is it is bizarre I can't remember the last time it happened especially in a recording oh well so let me know if you're continuing if, if it's got its hooks in you like when you played it was the gameplay better than the story the story better than the gameplay what what kept driving you forward it'll be interesting to know if what's driving you forward or drove you forward is different to me but until the next video or maybe until I see you again looking at other things on the site we have other playlists we have YouTube shorts but until the next time I see you Take care.